welcome back to my channel. Today's gonna be kind of a fun little video. It was fun for me. Um, I just found out that places like TJ Maxx and Marshalls and stuff, they're selling makeup. And not any makeup, they're selling high-end, like brand name, really good stuff. Um, Anastasia Beverly Hills and Smashbox and Lorac and all the good stuff that we always have to save up for and they're really reasonably priced. So I went to one of my local TJ Maxx's just to check it out and I was so pumped. I found so much cool stuff. So basically I'm gonna bring you through the things I found while I was in the store and I am gonna do a voiceover because there was like so many people around me and I think they were already like, that's so weird, why is she filming this? Cause I had like my iPhone out and, and you know, I didn't wanna like talk into it and, and raise any more suspicions. And I will also talk about, you know, the things I got, and I'm so pumped, so have fun on this journey with me. Hopefully it feels like you're shopping too, because shopping's the best. Shopping's the best. All right, have fun. Um, I also, after I went to the TJ Maxx, I was like, I gotta check out Marshalls too, because I really like Marshalls for a lot of things. So next time I will do Marshalls, I'm gonna let you know all the stuff I found, the prices, uh, what I got, what I didn't, because obviously if I had gotten everything I wanted, it literally would have been probably like $300, and I'm not saving money there, am I? Am I? Anyways, have fun with me shopping at CJ Maxx. And I'm not trying to be cheap, right? Like, I'm absolutely not at all trying to be cheap. I am a, you know, Rouge member at Sephora. That means I've spent like a thousand dollars this year at Sephora, and it is only May 1st. That means I've spent a lot of money at Sephora. But at the same time, I am on a budget. My husband tells me we're on a budget, and I have to rein in my spending and find places to save money. And in order to feed my beauty addiction, I, I sometimes have to, you know, find deals at places, and I have found them, and I want to share them with you because I know we're all beauty babes on a budget. Just budget babes, because it's not just beauty where I like to find a good budget. I found, like, the coolest thing there, too, so stay tuned till the end so you can see exactly, like, it's so awesome. I can't wait to try it. I am so excited. Okay, have fun with me. Goodbye! I mean, not goodbye, keep watching. And as always, like, subscribe, comment, tell me if you've been to TJ Maxx or Marshalls lately and you've seen these products that they're carrying. Let me know what you found. Let me know how much it was. Let me know everything. Sorry, I got loud there. There's like somebody mowing their lawn outside and I feel like I'm like competing with the sound of the lawnmower. Yeah, I realize it's nice out, but jeez. Ugh, it's always so noisy here. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. Gotta check my raid on first. The We've got some OPI Nail Envy, $9.99. Some NYX, looks like palettes with lipstick and eyeshadow. They had the Toronto and they had the Bangkok. I really uh, preferred the Bangkok, honestly, because it had some awesome purple lipstick. But the Toronto was $4.79, and in a second, you'll see the Bangkok was like $5.99, I want to say. So obviously... A lot of other people preferred the Bangkok too. Look at that purple. Oh my God. Look at the shades. Like the gunmetal gray, the purple, the sparkly purple. Awesome. I took it. I got it. I did. Here we have a bunch of Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lip gloss. Um, I think they were $7.99. It's going to show us in a second. Yep, $7.99, which is a really good price. And they have a lot of colors. Blues, purples, rose golds. This is a Kat Von D. Um, there was a bunch of those, too. That was a Kat Von D lipstick, $7.99. Here we've got some Smashbox lipsticks as well. They had a bunch of colors in those, too. The Be Legendary, $7.99. And Stila lipstick or lip gloss. Oh, yep. And how much is that? $3.99. What? 
socks. Did you see? I was like surprised. I was like, whoa, I did actually get one of those. I think that's a lip liner, but they, um, they had some lipsticks as well. And we have Pixie, a beautiful blue palette. I did get this $4.99. I love Pixie stuff. And here's some Lorac eye stuff. $9.99, not bad. Um, just a bunch of other random palettes. Really good stuff though. Estila palettes. Flip that around, girl. What you got? We got some Makeup Forever eyeshadows. So cute. Lots of colors. Not bad. An Ellen Tracy palette. What? $6.99. They had some great colors too. And Makeup Revolution eyeshadow palette as well. Oh, I love that purple and the blue and that teal color. And here we have an Anastasia Beverly Hills lip palette. Look at all those colors. $24.99. That's crazy. That's not, that's not expensive at all. We've got some Lorac stuff, looks like eyeshadow, some Algenis. I could not get this stuff out. It is a mess there sometime. This is actually $14.99 with like a bronzer, Lorac powder. Nope, it's a baked bronzer. $7.99. And a MAC look in a box. So there's lipstick and there's some eyeliner and eyeshadows. And we've got a MAC Very Valuable Pro Longwear Pencil Kit, $19.99 really good price. Oh, I love these NYX. I love these NYX lip creams and the lip glosses. It's $4.79. I did grab a couple of those. Oh, some velvet mattes. Those are really good too. $4.99. Is purple like the new color? Because I would totally rock purple. It's my favorite color. Here we have some foundation. It's the Better Skin 299. I believe it's Maybelline, but I guess I didn't get in the shot. Some airbrushed legs. Oh my god, I love that stuff. 299. Perfect in time for summer. What's up here? Oh, oh, these were these were like a bunch of glittery palettes. Like they had a strobe, a smoky. They were only $4.99 for them. Some glitter, you know I love eyeshadow glitter. So this is an eye cheek palette, $4.99. So it has eyeshadows and blushes. And we've got a shimmer, that's 10 eyeshadows and they're all sparkly, $4.99. Let's look at it, oh, look at them. And they're pretty sparkly too, they look really pigmented. We've got some Too Faced with the melted lipsticks. I love these. And they had them in like pinks and peaches. Really nice spring colors. They even had darker colors and another purple. Here we've got a $1.99 e.l.f. mattifying powder tr trio and $2.99 for the corrective concealer. It has the green and all the different colors. And here we have a Smashbox Full Exposure eyeshadow palette, $14.99. Some more e.l.f. stuff, liquid lipstick, $2.99. Oh my gosh, look at it, $2.99. And that's an e.l.f. eye refresh cream, and that was only $1.99. And e.l.f. perfect face palette. Up here we've got the Milani, it's an easy brow tinted fiber gel. How much? I didn't say how much it was. And that's some CoverGirl um, stuff as well. And here we have $7.99 for, what was it? They didn't show me what it was. Oh, it looks like a Lorac concealer or maybe a foundation. There's so much stuff over here. Look at all these eyelashes, like magnetic lashes. I've been wanting to try those so bad. Oh, I bought these too. They're, you know, colored eyeliners. I wanted to use them for my waterline when I'm trying looks. $2.99 for each. And some more infallible eyeliner. And that guy was $2.99 as well. Here we have some more Lorac stuff. Oh, I went back, great. So it's bronzing, $5.99. Um, what do we got here? Lorac eyeshadow. It's called Brunch, how awesome is that? $4.99, perfect. Some Algenis stuff we've got. Oh, nice, Algenis is great, $9.99. Most of that Algenis stuff was $9.99, by the way. We have Estila palette. What is it a palette or a bronzer? I don't know. 
What's here? Oh, brushes. Listen, TJ Maxx has some incredible, incredible brushes. If you are getting stuff from TJ Maxx, like brushes, you're gonna luck out because they're just as good as more expensive brushes. So this is what I got in my cart so far. Oh, and I bought these too. I mean, they're brushes that have mermaid tails on them. They're so cute, so pretty. And I really needed some more eye brushes, so let's just go with that. $4.99. Oh my goodness. So here's some more brushes, and here's a really great Eco Tools brush set. I love Eco Tools, they make great brushes. I think it was only $7.99, oh, $6.99, even better. Um, some more brushes. See how many brushes they have? So many brushes, beauty blenders. I think we're getting to the beauty blenders now. Yep. Look at these cute little guys. Oh my god, $2.99. You're not gonna find beauty blenders for that cheap anywhere else, honestly. If you go to Sephora, one beauty blender is like $20. I don't know what this is, but it's only $9.99. It looks awesome. Don't mind my nails in these videos, by the way. I just took my acrylics off and they're a mess. Oh my God, look at this. Oh, I got this, by the way. I love these little beauty blender holders. And it comes with the beauty blender. So an Urban Glow beauty blender and the holder. Oh my God, these cute makeup cleaners, like the makeup brush cleaners. They had one that looked like a cloud, one that looked like a watermelon. There's a rainbow one up there, $3.99. That's amazing. Look at that rainbow one. How adorable. $3.99. And this whole brush cleaning palette, which is a little kind of like a sink so that the water won't get everywhere. It's $5.99. I love I love this mascara, by the way, $4.99. You'll pay twice as much for that, even at a drugstore. Going in the cart. And I also got this. Remember I said I've been looking for an eye cream to depuff my eyes? Well, that is what it's supposed to do. And I've been using it for a couple days, and it's awesome. Tweezer Man. Now, these are expensive tweezers. They're only $9.99 here. They had two kinds, but they had this one and this one. I don't know what the difference is, but they're both. $9.99, so I guess whatever your preference is. Got some more e.l.f. stuff, some eyeshadow, $1.99. Oh my god, I found this. It was on clearance. It's three of those 24 karat collagen boosting masks, boosting masks on clearance for $8. I definitely, definitely got that. Now this is what I'm most excited about. I can't wait to try them and tell you guys if they worked or not. $8? I mean, for three masks, I'm doing it. Look at all these makeup wipes. And you've got some great names here. You've got the Shea Moisture, $3.99. You've got your Elba. How much are those? How much are those? $3.99. Some Avalon Organics, $3.99. Oh, the Ole Henriksen, $4.99. These are really good. The Clean Truth Cleansing Cloths, they have like vitamin C in them. They're supposed to brighten your face. Awesome. I don't know. This is, oh, look how cute this packaging is. $3.99. Can we talk about this facial power brush for a second by Vivitar? I mean, I have my Clarisonic and I love it, but it's so pretty. $9.99 and it's pink and sparkly. I love it. And of course, every time I'm at TJ Maxx and Marshalls, I gotta check out my athleisure. I love Under Armour and I love purple, so this gray Under Armour tank was perfect for me. And it's only what? It's $32.99 MSRP. What's the price? What's the price? $12.99? You take that, girl. Get it. And this is a little dirty secret of mine, but every time I'm here, I always go to the men's athleisure place, you know, and, and look for sweatpants. And look at these Puma dark blue sweatpants, $14.99 medium. I got you. I did get these. I'm currently wearing them as I'm talking to you. I'm looking through here, but there's nothing really else that interests me. But why do I want this? I, why do I want this? 
I didn't get it. I stopped myself because I felt like it was one of those purchases that I wouldn't want in the end. But why did I want it? All right, we're ringing out all our, all our purchases. So overall, really good haul at TJ Maxx. There was a lot of stuff I didn't get and a lot of stuff I did, but maybe I'll check out Marshall's next. Side.